We'll guide you through how to fix your USB Wi-Fi adapter not working in Windows. If you find this useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. First of all, come to the bottom of your computer and click on search and type in device manager like so. Now what you need to do is find network adapters and go and expand it and go and see if you can go and see your USB wireless adapter. If you can't, click on action at the top and click on scan for hardware changes and go and see if it then finds it. Now in my case, mine has already been found, but it's actually disabled. So all you need to do is right click on it and go and click on enable device if you've got that option. If it says disable device, then it means it's already enabled. So go and see if you can go and enable it and see if that solves your problem. However, if enabling it didn't fix your problem or it was already enabled, then go and right click on it and we're going to try updating it. So click on update driver. You can click on browse my computer for drivers and click on let me pick from a list. Choose the driver and you can press next and it will then go and install them. After it's finished, now go and see if it's now working. However, if it still isn't, then what you can try doing is coming to the bottom of your computer, click on search and type in CMD like so. You need to right click on it and click on run as administrator like so. You'll go and get a Windows security pop up. And then all you need to do is type in net sh. Now all you need to do is type in net sh space winsock space reset like so. And what you need to do is go and restart your computer to go complete the reset and that will hopefully go and solve your problem. So you can click on the Windows button, then click on the power button and click on restart. That's it. If you found this useful, then leave a like.